So, hello. Hello. So, uh, this is, uh, my name is Leonardo. I'm uh, architect, Italian architect. And uh, this is uh, surprising to me, as it is surprising for maybe for, for you as well. Um, not for some people, but some people knew about this. Uh, but uh, anyway, so this is my YouTube channel called the Egyptian Feeling. And I've been fascinated by ancient Egypt since I was really, 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 really young. I have got a picture of me on the beach uh, building the pyramids and uh, I'm gonna post it one day. Um, and so what, what I would like to do with this channel is share with you what I know about Egypt, but especially learn with you. Learn with your questions, learn with your... and everything that I, like, I present to you or anything that I think is worth it or studying or uh, about ancient Egypt, I would like your feedback. Uh, I would like you to tell me and ask questions so that I can also study study more and deep dive more into what on what I already know about ancient Egypt. And I have to tell you, I'm an architect, so I, my background is architecture, is not history, is not archaeology, is not nothing like that. But um, I, I have to say, actually, I, I have to thank uh, Sylvia uh, because uh, she uh, one year ago I was in a, in a, living in Algarve in a, in the Good Feeling Hostel, and uh, she was like, "Why don't we go for a travel in Egypt?" And I was like, "Hey, I don't have the money," and uh, and um, and so. I bought uh, a book about ancient Egypt and um, I started uh, just studying more and more and more and she woke, woke up my ancient Egyptian uh, passion that was sleeping uh, inside of me for many many years and um, and eventually I, I, was, I, le I lived all this one year ago, it was just one year ago and I lived all this year without much money and and uh, and eventually a friend of mine, George, which is upstairs now controlling the music, uh, he got he got um, like a job for me in uh, for for one month in Egypt, and I was like, that's it. <laughs> so I finally got in, in Egypt. It was not the first time, but it's the first time since I since I uh, I woke up again. Uh, with this feeling and so uh, what I, I, I mean, this is like it's not this is not the entire story I mean this is just the last year story and um, but I've been deep diving into ancient Egypt and what I would like to, to, to do is like, I, I'm, I'm set I'm not I don't want to set up this channel to be like specific and uh, to be like just about a few stuff because there are a lot of channels in, in English uh, anyway that are way more advanced in terms of like uh, ancient technology or ancient uh, traditions or religion or um, archaeology itself. There are so many channels already. So what I would like to do is uh, here is, is really just to share my adventure, my journey, uh, personal. Um, diving into this topic of ancient Egypt and uh, you will you, you will like to know why like what 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 is what is that matters to me about ancient Egypt I don't know I don't know I don't have, I don't know what is that matters to me uh, it might be the desert it might be the architecture it might be the fact that ancient the fact that at least from the old kingdom even pre dynastically but uh, from the old kingdom to nowadays, ancient ancient Egypt was the civilization that basically is on the basis of Western civilizations. At, at, at least what I what, what I consider the, the is not so. So the thing is that in in university, I remember the first year of university in Milan in architecture. I had this teacher. Uh, she was uh, already like. 80 years or something, I don't know, she was like, 
And um, and I remember the first lesson. She was like, "We're not going to study ancient Egypt." Uh, she was the the, the 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 teacher of history of architecture in the Polytechnic of Milan. She was she, and she said the first thing she said, "We're not going to study ancient Egypt because uh, she was from the party of the Greeks." And she was like, uh, "We're not going to study ancient Egypt because." They were. They didn't produce anything so so intellectually sophisticated enough, worth it, to for us to study. And I was like, <laughs> fine, <laughs> just fine, just okay, fine. <laughs> but so then, and uh, it's okay. So then, nothing, nothing really happened for me. But eventually I ended up studying ancient Egypt anyway without <laughs> without the polytechnic or assisting in it um, and so so yeah I have to say to that uh, ancient like at least our civilization uh, the Western civilization is based on ancient Egypt uh, civilization and uh, we don't recognize it we don't recognize how much uh, the religion that Christian religion, of the Western civilization has in common with ancient Egypt religion, and we don't realize how much of the structure of the um, of the society uh, began from ancient Egypt, and we don't. When, when you when you when you start studying ancient Egypt, you do, you realize that that's the that's where. That's where that is where a lot of our civilization um, belong. Well, that's where our civilization belong. Uh, I, I always thought that the Greeks or the Romans were the the, the guys in charge of our of our uh, past. But no, it's um, it's ancient Egypt, and, and we don't recognize it. We 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 live our lives and whatever uh, without thinking of much. How much in common we have with with with, uh, with ancient Egypt? For instance, just uh, just a quick example. I, I, I can do whatever, like a lot of examples, but just in my mind at the moment, it's um, I remember in Saqqara, um, I, I went in, so in Saqqara there is there are a lot of things in Saqqara, but one of the things, uh, one of the most important is the pyramids of Djoser, which is the step pyramid, and uh, I saw columns that were exactly like the not exactly but precise, re, like super super um, close in aesthetic to the Greek columns, and uh, there are two thousand years of difference. And guess who came first? And so this is very superficial and very I know, but it's just to tell that. Greek column didn't, for example, didn't was not born in Greece, and uh, and the and the, the capitals as well, the, the capitals uh, maybe in English capital, they were not born in Greece, they were born in Egypt, and all this like uh, I think what I'm trying to do here is just to highlight the fact that ancient Egypt is uh, our we live on the shoulder of the ancient Egypt, ancient Egyptians, and not just the Greeks and the Romans. And so, I mean, just quick pyramid here, just to, because uh, this is my house, my place. So, I, um, yeah, I don't have a studio <laughs> to set up lights and stuff, but we're working on it. So this is the first video, just to introduce uh, myself to you. And uh, what I'm planning to do with this channel is. Uh, I don't know. I didn't, I didn't plan much, but I'm sure that I want to put out comment contents, and I'm sure I, what I want is for you to make questions on the contents that I put out. And one thing is for sure, uh, I don't want to leave architecture at the side. I would like to introduce architecture here in this channel. So, for example, there are. Um, I'm not sure about the temples. Maybe we. Maybe we deep dive into the temples, uh, maybe we do it, because uh, it's, it's a lot of heritage that we can go through. And uh, all the temples are so different, they uh, have different stories, and it's just... 
crazy. Uh, but I will. F I, I, I suppose I will start with the uh, the pre-dynastic Egypt, so before the pharaohs, and then we we can go on with the old kingdom, and middle kingdom, and new kingdom, and maybe we stop with uh, with the Ptolemies. So let's see. But um, so this won't be a, ch a history channel. Won't be history channel. This is uh, feedback, community-based channel. Uh, so let's see how it goes. And uh, George, can you put more up the music, please? <laughs> Grazie. Uh, so let's start. Bye bye.